Bitcoin surged by almost 11% minutes after the U.S. Central Bank committed to unlimited purchasing of U.S. Treasury's mortgage-backed securities to help its struggling economy amidst coronavirus pandemic. The announcement sent Bitcoin towards its new intraday high at $6,641. It also left traditional markets in a positive area, with the benchmark S&P 500 index climbing by almost 7.8% in just 23 minutes. Safe haven ASIC gold, meanwhile, surged by up to 1.69%. Elsewhere in the cryptocurrency market, almost all the top assets followed Bitcoin's Q. The second largest coin, Ethereum, soared by more than 10%, while XRP, the third largest asset among the top 10, jumped 8.18%. Other assets, including Bitcoin Cash, Litecoin, Bitcoin SV, Binance Coin, and EOS, also rose in the range of 6 and 10%. The Fed's infinite quantitative easing program has led Bitcoin supporters to project the cryptocurrency as an alternative. Popular market commentator Hodlonot pitted the US dollar's open-ended supply against Bitcoin's scarcity, noting that investors would want to purchase the latter as protection against a potentially hyperinflated market. Veteran trader Ronnie Moas, meanwhile, discussed the possibility of Bitcoin closing above its all-time high of $20,000 in 2020 under the updated market fundamentals. He wrote, part of the explanation came from Gabor Gerbax, the director at VanEck's Digital Assets Wing, who noted that investors would treat Bitcoin as a risk on asset during the Fed's QE.